morning, beautiful people. Good morning, beautiful people. Today we are crossing into Ecuador. So, Sara, please explain uh, which border are we crossing into. Okay, there are two borders. One in Ipiales, the, the biggest one, the famous one, and the second one that is straight. It's right into the Amazon forest. It's called San Miguel. We took 10 hours, 9 hours to make the road because as you can see it's 85% paved and fifteen, fifteen 15%, 10% unpaved. So it's really slowly but it's beautiful. You are in the forest, in the jungle. Explain which one we are taking. We are taking the one in San Miguel. Okay. So we are taking the, the second one, the secondary one in San Miguel. Today's plan uh, is to get uh, to Coca. This is our goal for the day. We will see how far we get. Uh, we don't know how many hours we will spend to get uh, through the border. It should be easy, it should be yeah. free. We will see. They said that it's really easy to cross this border, at least easier than the biggest one in Ipiales. Let's see. Only the people that try will see what it looks like. We will um, enter in Ecuador, we will drive through Nueva Loja, and then we will arrive in Coca, that it's in the Amazon rainforest uh, in Ecuador. Yesterday, when we stopped uh, to find a Wi-Fi to upload uh, one of our latest video, we just stopped in a hostel and was full of monkeys. We feed the monkeys. It was amazing. Here are the images. Piccola, quello piccolo lì.
for us to find a good Wi-Fi to upload our vlog even when we pay for a hostel, for a place to stay, just for the Wi-Fi, for the shower, to park Lucky Liu and to use the Wi-Fi at 5 p.m. every day the Wi-Fi just stopped working. It looks so, so cute, uh, all the plants are there. Yeah. And then suddenly I got sick. I felt so bad last two days. I have high fever, was really painful, but luckily here we are. Dr. Luca, save her! Capisci, capisci a me? Che cosa dici? Lovely Dr. Luca! Mannaggia, mannaggia, mannaggia! So guys, here we are on this beautiful road. All dirt. All dirt. But it's nice. We met the other travelers that crossed the border two days ago after the deal between the president and the indigenous people and they said the situation is back to normal. So we are quite confident to cross the border today. I think we are at the border, like uh, as you can see here on the map, uh, oh, we will cross a bridge uh, and on the other side of the bridge is Ecuador and on this side of the bridge uh, is Colombia. So it's uh, Rio San Miguel, as you can see here, Rio San Miguel. So now we just need to find uh, where is the place. Compramenda pesos y dólares. Ah, sí. And just like this. I'm heading to Ecuador. To Ecuador. Hola. Hola. Okay, guys, we are, we are officially in Ecuador, but uh, we didn't make the, the border yet. Uh, we have to go like to the aduana to make all the papers. Uh, but we are already on Ecuadorian uh, land. How do we look in Ecuador? Different? <laughs> Always the same face. Ah, okay. New chapter. Did you miss the border crossing? <laughs> no, 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 no. We already changed, uh, so we changed the money before the bridge, uh, before getting into Ecuador. The rate actually was really good, like uh, we were looking uh, online. Uh, they, yeah, super good. They give us a super good rate. Uh, like uh, for one dollar, 3,500 pesos, that is really good rate, just the bank. Probably they are fake money or <laughs> no, no. no I'm joking I'm joking they, they give us really a good rate and yes now we are in a country with dollars again only we the don't coins, need to exchange uh, yeah only the coins uh, are uh, Ecuadorian dollars uh, but all the paper money is just uh, the but normal it's the same dollar. value no yeah the same value see you in a minute at the immigration office
Okay, we finally made it to the Ecuador uh, aduana, the Ecuador border, and look this. Uh, you have showers 24-7, uh, uh, free, free okay. showers. Uh, you have, uh, you can call, you can have internet, one hour yeah. free. You have one hour free internet, two minutes you can call, and 30 minutes you can charge your batteries your phone batteries yeah. uh, this is really really cool yeah. i like this uh, aduana this border is really really cool well done ecuador hola buenas ecuador de colombia ecuador de colombia ecuador de colombia okay we're doing now the documents uh, there you can see lucky liu sarah it's a uh, doing now let's do all the papers you will have uh, first uh, to um, cancel your papers uh, of Colombia so you will go here at the aduana de Colombia and then after you will come here and you will do the Ecuadorian uh, temporary permit uh, on this side So now we will wait uh, because what time is it, Sara? Now it's uh, 12 30 12 30. And, uh, and everybody went to lunch uh, as you can see. Nobody's here, nobody's there. So they tell us wait uh, 30 minutes and they will be back. Yes, and we stay exactly two months in uh, Colombia. Yes, yeah, Sara was almost. Uh, almost two months. Uh, she was looking into the stamps uh, on uh, our passports uh, and you can see. see 15 August. We entered the 15th of August uh, and we're Today. getting. Uh, I'll show it on your side, it's on the same page. Uh. Yeah. So we enter the 15th of August and we are getting out the 17th. Nice passport, Sarah. Well done. <laughs> okay, we done all the papers. Uh, the um, all the, the procedure is for free. The officer was really nice and cool. He told us uh, everything we have to do. So now we will have to go to the first town uh, and buy the insurance. Uh, it's and called yeah, uh, yes, it's Ecuador. called uh, SOAT, uh, like in Colombia, but uh, you have to do it also for Ecuador. It's mandatory, yeah. so without uh, insurance, they can uh, fine you. So let's do the insurance uh, at the next town. Uh, and uh, yeah, we have done all the papers. Uh, we are ready to go to enter Ecuador. Yes, and everything, as I said, was for free. The officer told us that the police, everyone is here to protect and to help tourists. So if uh, we have problems, if we feel not safe, uh, we just need to call the 911 and they can help us. Yeah, they, so, they told us which uh, SIM card, which chip uh, it's better for our phone. So we will buy a Claro that has more uh, antennas uh, here in uh, Ecuador so let's go and uh, okay, see now how let's go to buy the insurance and the sim the sim card, the sim uh, the card chip. and uh, then we are free to move on let's go Ciao. <laughs> crossing ever
We arrived in Coca. We made it. Today was a long day. We crossed the border. Everything was nice and smooth. It was really better than we expected. At the end, the insurance for our car is not mandatory. It's not necessary. We spent two, three hours in Lago Agrio. Yes, the, the guy at the border say, <laughs> said to us that we had to do the SOAT. Uh, is how they call it in Colombia. But here it's not mandatory if you are a foreign end, uh, vehicle just traveling and passing through the country with a temporary permission. So yeah, they had a thought until 2005 or 2006. And I there think. is a, a mandatory insurance for the Ecuadorian resident vehicles with the Ecuadorian plates, but it's not our case. Yeah, I think just the, the, the guy at the border just got confused and gave us uh, wrong information. So we asked the police, we went to the, the transportation office uh, and we asked it. They didn't know exactly what to say to us. They say, oh, but you do the inspection. They say, we have everything. We have our temporary importation permit for Ecuador, so we are good to go. And now we park, like you do, in this hostel. We found in the, a safe place where to live, like Liu, because uh, we are going on an adventure. Yes, guys, we will bring you with us uh, in the heart of the Amazon forest, the Amazon basin in Ecuador. Let's go. So please stay tuned, see the next video. We love you guys, we appreciate you. Thank you for coming with us and to travel with us. If you like the video, please give us a thumbs up. Uh, Consider to subscribe to our channel if you haven't done already. See you on the next one and the next video on the heart of the Amazon here in Ecuador. Ciao guys, love you. Ciao. So they can shine right down on us and we can watch them glow. We can watch them.